modern beers in Mexico have a rather short history, but brewing in the region dates back to the 1500s. This is far earlier than any similar process found anywhere else in North America, and where we begin this history of Mexican beer. Early tribes native to what is modern-day Mexico were already well aware of fermentation. They produced an alcoholic drink from corn, agave, or fruits known as tesquino. The drink is still around today, but mostly by family members who hold true to a passed down recipe. The actual creation of a product similar to beer did not occur until Hernan Cortes and the Spanish conquest began in the 1500s. The Spanish army brought small amounts of barley to produce small batches of beer. An individual by the name of Alfonso de Herrero created the first official Mexican brewery in 1543, producing European-influenced beer. Spanish colonials helped make the beer popular, but their regional government put in place by Spain heavily taxed production in order to force the import of European beer. By making imported beer less expensive, the brewery eventually shut down. In 1810, when Mexico defeated the Spanish in its fight for independence, taxation of locally produced beer stopped. The fall of the Spanish Empire in Mexico brought with it a new influx of European immigrants, many hailing from Germany and the Austro-Hungarian Empire. In 1863, the Second Mexican Empire was formed, with the backing of Napoleon III of France and Isabel II of Spain. Austrian Archduke Ferdinand Maximilian was named Emperor of Mexico, and with it, he brought his own personal Vienna-style brewer when he migrated to Mexico City. This helped solidify the Vienna-style lager in Mexico, despite the Second Mexican Empire falling just four years later and the execution of Emperor Maximilian. Just before the turn of the century, several new beer labels popped up, including Bohemia, Dos Equis, Carta Blanca, and Victoria. When prohibition in the United States hit, the Mexican beer market flourished as Americans crossed the border into Mexico in order to drink. With the eventual fallout of World War I, breweries in Mexico focused more on locally sourced material and started to produce lighter beers. Modelo Especial and Corona both popped up in 1925. While beer in the United States has shifted towards a micro, small batch style for the last several decades, Mexican beer is just starting to enter the micro beer phase. However, with new regional breweries opening throughout the country, a new golden age of Mexican beer may be right around the corner.